uh, greetings there, Gold Seekers. This is Tim for Blue League Gold Productions. Where else would I be on a day when the temperature is climbing towards 90 degrees? Right here on the Yuba. And uh, today, I am out with Sean. Uh, Sean's out there. He's running his little sluice. Um, we uh, had driven into Sean's claim. He's got a, a claim way up, uh, up closer to Washington on the South Yuba. And um, we were doing a little bit of road maintenance and such, uh, pouring some gravel and some ruts and cutting branches and making it so he'll be able to get in and out of his claim. And then we uh, came down here, uh, got down here about maybe one o'clock and we've got to leave by, apparently we got to leave by about uh, 2.30. So this is going to be a short video, but yeah, check it out. This is a beautiful spot. It's a beautiful day and got the Angus set up. And better than that, we got our first clean out. And take a look, we got some gold here. Loads of shiny flakes in that first clean out. And we got a nice picker to boot. So I'll be happy about that. Uh, I'll show you where we did I'm hoping we'll have time to get these four more buckets through before we gotta pack up and head on up the hill. I'm not just here with Sean today. I'm here with Leo today. Leo! Come on over here, say hello to the gold seekers, bud. Oh, such a good boy, such a good boy. Leo's a really good dog. That's a good boy, and Leo's been swimming. If you uh, had to run around in a fur coat in 90 degree weather, you'd spend your time swimming in the Yuba Doo. Uh, that was not Yuba Doo like Yabba Dabba Doo, that was in the Yuba too. See, look at that, look at that there, gold seekers. We got a ramp straggler right down there gold is heavy stuff it's amazing how it can just kind of sit there on top of a ripple like that it's still sitting there right on top of that ripple all right so this is where we're digging right here standing on bedrock and this big boulder here is leaning up against the bedrock I dug out a bunch of packed gravel from down in that, that crack between the two. And if you'll notice that it's all about the gravel. Um, we've got a bunch of red, rusty, hydraulic pay here. Uh, 99 uh, cents uh, is the bet that this red, rusty pay came out of the Molokov diggings. I've said it before and I'll say it again. God bless the grotesque inefficiency of the old timers sluice boxes. Otherwise, we wouldn't have no gold here on the uh, South Yuba. Well, I'm afraid this is all we're gonna get done for today. But if you'll notice, we did have a nice concealed cubby hole developed. There's still plenty of bedrock here. And lots of bedrock here that could be, be cleared off. And I bet, you there, I bet you there's gold underneath it. I bet you there's gold all throughout this area here. Well, gold seeker Sean is packed up. He's ready to roll. I, on the other hand, have just had a, a delightful Yuba swim, and I need to pan out those concentrates before we can go anywhere. It is up to me. We'd be staying a lot longer today, but Sean's got to get back to the Bay Area. So let me show you the gold for the day real quick, and then we'll sign off. Okay, and there it is. That's the gold for the day. A short day, like about a two and a half hour a day so that's plenty of gold for a short day like that and I'm gonna be happy with it because uh, it's been a beautiful day down here and I've had some nice swims so until next time this is Tim for Blue Lead Gold Productions saying Aloha, Aloha.